I'm starving. We stopped for food 20 minutes ago. You call that food? Come on, Ben. Can't you try to appreciate the unique culture around you? Your cousin is right, Ben. I mean, who knows when we'll get to have freshly roasted liverwurst again? Maybe a cheeseburger doesn't sound so bad. Uh, Grandpa, did you forget what side of the road to drive on again? Oops. <laughs> Thank you, Gwen. Hey, I'll have this down by the end of our European adventure. Whoa! What was that flash? Mm, probably just lightning. There's not a cloud in the sky. Let's go check it out. Ugh, this better not be another incredible historical land... It came from this way! What? Is that... Hicks? Ben Tennyson? Here to foil my brilliant plan. Let's see how you do without the help of your ridiculous aliens! What did you do? Feeling outmatched. Imagine how you'll feel when I found the other three power crystals. With their energy combined, I shall be unstoppable! You won't get away with this, Hex! Ben! Are you okay? I'm fine. But my aliens! That crystal is no joke if it was able to damage the Omnitrix. Hex must have dropped this. I've never seen inscriptions like this before. Maybe it has some clues about those crystals he mentioned. What? What's going on? Did a tree fall? Should I get my first aid kit? The forest is in a panic. We just had a pretty close call, but everyone is fine. Good. Good, good. I'm, uh, I'm Ryan, park ranger of Grisenball Forest. Uh, would you be willing to make a statement about this incident? Sure, Gwen. Maybe you could check out that tablet back at the rust bucket while I give the statement. Good plan. Um, excellent. Meet me at my cabin when you're ready. I'll be ready to take down your account of the incident in just a moment. As you can see, there's quite a panic among the forest critters. My critter radar, I call it the Kradar, <laughs> shows animals uh, fleeing the park. Maybe I can help calm them down? Good! Uh, could you take this cassette tape to the radio tower? The soothing sound of smooth jazz should do the trick. Huh, okay. Just one thing. What's a cassette tape? Oh boy. Ah, well, maybe our other volunteer will know. Kevin, come meet Ben. Kevin? Oh, you know one another. Excellent. We know each other, all right. Listen, Ben, I know we haven't always been the best at working together. But Hex and his crystal might be a little more than you can handle. How do you know? Whenever you mess things up and need my help, I'll be around to lend a hand or a claw. Nailed it! Uh-oh. That's a problem for later. First, I have to get to the radio tower.
picking up all of her strudel back. It must be related to Hex. Mm. With the gate blocked, this might be my only way out of here. I'm going in. coming. Excellent work, Ben. It should calm the nerves in the park. It all went smoothly, except that tree that fell right behind me. Oh, it's been happening all over the park. I can help with that. Oh, well, okay. Um, there's a saw in the shed out back. Oh, I won't be needing that. I've got the ultimate firepower. Please, hold the applause.
flame. It's good to see you, Ben. I was getting nervous and was about to come check on you. Don't worry. I got to the root of the problem. Excellent. But let's head inside and... Oh, my keys. That blasted bird nests nearby every year and will steal anything shiny for her nest. Hang tight. I'll have your keys in no time. Another day saved. King of the Scoops! Shouldn't have doubted you. Maybe you could look into this call I just received. There's some rogue wildlife harassing park goers in the picnic area. Leave it to me. Those bandits won't be stealing any more picnic baskets. Add that to my list of accomplishments. Wants a BBQ'd monster for dinner. Thank goodness you scared away those, well, whatever they were. Now, if only someone would stop lost in that music, we could get back to our date. Hey, you seem pretty good at conflict resolution. Maybe you could ask them to keep it down. You'd be a hero. Are we forgetting I just defeated a horde of vicious monsters? Fine. Concert. This could mean treble. Ben Tennyson. Here to see a show by the one and only DJ of Destructive Sound. 
Lord Decibel! I reserve you a front row seat that will cost you. How does a million dollars and a euro sound? I wouldn't spend a cent of my allowance on your music. You disabled my Omnitrix? How? <laughs> Through simple sonic manipulation, a world-class DJ like myself is a master of all things sound. Bend all the notes you want. I can still stop you. This is my end of the world tour. I'll be bringing down the house all over Strudelbeck and charging top dollar. Anyone who doesn't pay up will get a very special bass drop. Prepare to be cancelled, Decibel. venue, but this was just the opening act. I better keep an ear out for Lord Decibel's concerts. He won't be jamming once I show up. First, I need to find Ranger Ryan and tell him about those raccoons I found. Searching everywhere for you. We've got bigger problems than raccoons. Uh, you can say that again. The picnic area was infested with actual monsters. <sighs> and I thought Strudelbeck would be a relaxing, peaceful place to be a park ranger. Hi, I am Stefan. Nice to meet you, Ben. Ranger Ryan has told me you've proven to be very helpful here in the park. I've heard reports of strange activity in a few areas. Why don't you open your map and look? One of the locations is Grashugel Village, where I am mayor. And I could really use your help around town. You need to investigate one of the three locations. I'll keep the park under control. Thanks, Ranger Ryan. I'll do my best to get to the bottom of this. Gwen, find anything on that tablet? I've just started to decode the inscriptions, but I think it definitely mentions the crystals. That's not why I called, though. Grandpa said he could use your help at the rest bucket. I'll be right there. Radical! Hiya, Ben. Seems like the rust bucket broke down between a rock and a hard place. While I get us out of this pickle, I could use your help getting a fire started so we can grill some grub. You made this sound important. No problem, Grandpa. Oh, I saw some good firewood around the park.
one. Pretty awesome. Look at that fire. So, what'll it be, Gwen? Uh, hot dogs or hamburgers? Both. We'll save some for you too, Ben. Now that the rust bucket's back in order, I can give you a lift so you can save the world even faster. <laughs> and I'll hold on to any cool stuff you find around Strudelbeck. Looks like I have a big adventure ahead of me. Now, where should I go first? Ben 10, power trip. Upgrade a day keeps the doctor away. Clams, the shopkeeper around these parts. I see you've got some coins you're just itching to spend. Take a look at my shop. I'm sure you'll find something to buy. I got the goods you're looking for. Have you ever tried to touch your toes? I'm gonna scoot. Good to see you again, Ben. I hope you're still up to get things back in order. Sure. Are you okay, though? Oh, don't worry about me. I'm the Burgermeister, after all. No way! Burgermeister, I'm starving!
Bürgermeister is our word for mayor. Oh, I guess that's cool too. So what's wrong with it? This incident has jeopardized the Lumberjack Festival! What happened? Our landscapers were inexplicably scared away mid-raking. Now there are piles of leaves all over town. The village must dazzle the other teams. I'd be eternally grateful if you would pick up where they left off, Ben. Leave it to me, Mr. Mayor. Does it look? I'll go out on a limb and say the town looks great. Excellent! Thanks, Ben! We've been having some issues with the power in town. That's something I can fix in no time. I'm pretty good with electricity for a ten-year-old. Oh, how kind of you! Uh, if you follow the power lines out of town, you should find the Transformers.
Good fight. <laughs> Wants a BBQ'd monster for dinner. I've got a fireball with your name on it.
I'm not giving up. Whoops, I'll give it another go. Thank you, Ben. Now I can read my... Uh, my very long to-do list. Oh, I'm freaking out. So, what else can I do to help? Grashugel has always had a world-class lumberjack team. But this year, as embarrassing as it is, our team has showed up beardless. Lumberjacks without beards? Lumberjacks without beards. Our last hope is Dr. Fibian, the local scientist. She may be able to whip something up that will get some whiskers on our team in time for the festival. A scientist? Cool! Be back soon! Uh, by the way, there are civilians around town that could probably use your help. I hope you wouldn't mind looking into them. You got it, Mayor. will make me stronger. Tubular!
cool. Found all the items you need. Let's pretend that we need this long to get you into an extra flannel. A pinch of this and dash of that. And done. Here you are, Ben. The beard growth serum should have those baby faces looking like a team of Sasquatches in no time. I'll take this to the Lumberjacks right away. Do 
Scooter Commuter. Where to next? The Rust Bucket is here to help. How can I help, Ben? Here we go. You must be Ben. Major Stefan told us you were coming. Right, hi. You're all looking kind of lumberjack-ish, I guess. Just wait. Let's get those beards on. It worked. Those beards look totally normal. Thanks. We're going to get back to work preparing for the festival. Ben, good to see you again. Thank you again for helping with the lumberjacks. Dr. Fibian saves the day once again. No problem. So what do you need my help with? Father Abernathy's carrots ripened today, and he has got no one to help pick them. Are you sure these are the most important tasks to be doing when there's a supernatural force on the loose? Clearly you have never had a fresh big carrot from Father Abernathy. Anyway, as Burgermeister, I think I know what the most important tasks are for this town. Uh, all right, if you say so. At least it isn't broccoli. Try those famous carrots. Yeah! 
Thank you, laddie. I was sure I was done for. How's out picking me carrots? Oh, gosh, me carrots! Oh, well, now I won't have to bother with picking them. Uh, I'd better get going. I'm helping prepare for the Lumberjack Festival. Oh, uh, before you head off, there's been a strange sound coming from me barn. I'm afraid it could be more monsters. Uh, why is it always monsters? Fine, I'll take a look. is back in action and ready to lend a hand. Or four. Out of my way. Time for some action. Thank <laughs> you. 
me? You're outnumbered! Four arms to two! Prepare for impact! The barn was crawling with monsters. Good thing you didn't go in there yourself. Oh, dear. Oh, thanks, Shalady. I'll be more careful from now on. One step closer to another wonderful Lumberjack Festival. Thanks, but Farmer Abernathy's carrot field was destroyed when I got there. What? Oh, this will raise my spirits. Ben, meet the Grashugal Lumberjack team. Hello, Ben. Is everything set up for the festival then? Well, we've had some trouble getting the big logs out of the lumber yard. Yeah. We're stomped. I'm sure Ben here could handle it. Uh, can't you, Ben? Well, hanging out with lumberjacks does sound fun. Meet us at the lumber yard when you're ready. Strudelbeck is the greatest. This will definitely... <laughs> My cool scooter tricks.
coming.